Hello everyone, my name is Nick and today I'm going to be talking about drone laws. Now I get asked all the time about drone laws in different states, cities, and counties. So in this 50 part series, I'm going to go over every single drone law that you need to follow. Now make sure you hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. Oh, also, this is not legal advice. Now either you live in or plan on visiting Washington and you want to fly your drone, here's every drone law you need to follow. Now there's three different parts to this. There's the federal, there's state, and there's city laws. And you need to follow all of them. Now first let's go over the federal laws. Now if you're flying for fun, a la not for money, here is every federal law you need to follow. But if you are flying for cash, skip to this time code. You must register your drone with the FAA Drone Zone website. I'll link it below. You must fly within visual sight. You must fly below 400 feet. Your drone must be under 55 pounds. You must never fly near another aircraft. If you're flying within five miles of an airport, you must notify the control tower. And you must never fly near emergency response efforts. Now for the commercial flyers. You must hold a remote pilot's license issued by the FAA. You must also register your drone with the FAA Drone Zone website. Your drone must be under 55 pounds. You must fly within Class G airspace. You must fly below 400 feet. You can only fly during daytime or at civil twilight, which is 30 minutes after sunset. You must fly under 100 miles per hour. You must yield the right of way to all manned aircraft can't fly over people. And lastly, you must not fly from a moving vehicle unless you're in a lightly populated area. Now these things can be weighed by the FAA, but you must get a waiver beforehand. Now that we got the federal laws out of the way, here are the state laws. Drone flight is not allowed at any Bellevue parks. Now if you do plan on flying out there, I do recommend checking out this guidebook. It details local laws, but it also gives you contact information for questions. You are also not allowed to fly within 400 feet of the lateral boundaries of numerous Department of Energy facilities, including the Hanford site in Franklin County. Now for the city laws. In Seattle, you are not allowed to fly your drone at any park. And that's it. Those are all the drone laws you need to follow in Washington. Thank you for watching. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments below. I'll see you next time.